Hi, my name is Stoney, music producer, mentor here at Pure Mind, and I'm excited to bring you all the new features that are in Machina Mark III, and I also want to bring you uh, all the features that are in Machine and talk about production and learn some pretty cool things. The first thing I want to talk about are some of the new features, of course, in the Mark III. And the first thing you're going to notice are these two incredible screens, which will allow you to produce without having to stare at a computer screen. And the other thing I want to talk about in this video is the four-way encoder that has been added to the unit, which allows you to browse and select and scroll through different pages and allow you to improve your workflow, actually. So the first thing I'm going to do now is I'm going to go to the browser and I'm going to click over to the left and I'm going to select one of the expansion packs that Native Instruments sells and uh, for machine which is incredible because the sounds are just like all types of different genres and we'll dig into that in a, in a later video so I'm gonna go to decoded forms and then I'm going to just click over with the encoder to where it says kits now with machine unit that two or three different ways to do the same thing with without the encoder I would have to come here and actually go to kits here and then I would have to touch this encoder this uh, knob here and go through the expansions but with the four-way encoder it allows me to jump from section to section and then I can go to kicks and then I can click over to the subtypes and choose a subtype which I'm going to choose analog and then I can click over and then I can now start and choose which ex kit I'm actually going to load so I'm gonna load this kit up uh, there's two ways I could do it I could just click the encoder and do everything from the encoder or I can come up here and click the load button so we're gonna press the encoder click down on that I'm gonna load this kit and now the kit is loaded and we'll come out of the browser and then I'm going to show you some other cool things you can do with the encoder I'm gonna hit pattern and so now let me get a nice drum kit in here now with the two screens I'm able to see what I'm doing as far as making patterns and sequencing. So I'm going to hit Arranger. Once I hit Arranger, there are different options up here. You have the Section option, and you have the Pattern option. The Pattern option will allow me to see the notes that I'm sequencing once I hit Record, and I start creating a pattern. So the first thing I'm going to do is turn on the metronome, and then I'm going to come and change the tempo, make it to the tempo that I like. And then I'm going to hit Shift Record. Okay, and then I'm going to hit Shift Record. And once I hit Shift Record, you'll see that the notes are going to start recording. Now you notice automatically you see the notes in here so you can see a full screen of the actual full pattern in its two bars and then on the right screen I have the option to zoom in and zoom out so that I can see the different events that happen within that pattern and then if you notice on the left side it grids exactly what's happening on the right side so now again now we're talking about the screen so once I press play I'm going to go into the mixer and then I'm going to use the encoder to manipulate some things I'm going to go to the mixer, and now I can see all my channels. So with the encoder, I can now come here and select whatever channel I want and actually turn it up or down. Now with the encoder, I can also look at all the channels as each pad on the mixer, or I can click up 
and actually see the group channel right here and I can then turn that down as well. I'll turn the entire group down. Now if I didn't use the four-way encoder, the way that I would do it is I would come here and I would go to each individual knob here and turn it down and then I would have to select each channel from the top. So I'd have to go here and then I have to come down. Then I have to come here and do that. But with the encoder knob, I'm able to do two actions in one. I can actually turn up and down and then I can actually move the channels with the encoder as well. So there's some pretty awesome stuff that they've added to improve the workflow. Again, my name is Stoney. You can find me at the Peer Mind um, Mentor page and you could uh, book a session with me and we can go deeper and into those different things that I showed you today. Or you could also follow me on social media, Stoney's Music on Twitter and Instagram. I look forward to bringing more content, and more videos, and to sharing more knowledge about machine. Take care. The Pyramind Mentorship Network connects you to experienced professionals for truly customized private training in music production, sound design, music business, and more. Use our scheduling tool to select the type of training you want, pick your mentor, find a day and time that works best for you, then book your session. Your appointment will be confirmed instantly. Study only what you want, progress at your own pace, pay as you go, and do it all from the comfort of your home or studio. Our global network of industry experts are here to help you. Visit pyramind.com slash mentorship to get started.